Well, well. Good evening. It's Friday. And I am back on that Dragon's Dogma grind. Hey look, <clears throat> there must be a patch. That new game option never used to be there. Cool. I hope they haven't screwed things up too much. I bet they have. Mm. Bit of a later start today. I was doing some programming. You know how it is. On my top secret project. Which isn't top secret really. I just wanted to sound cool in my community post. So, let's jump in. Oh yeah, we're supposed to be investigating the False Sovereign. To be fair, we've got no proof he's a False Sovereign. It's all, uh... Supposition, at this point. Isn't that right, Frank? It's all supposition. It sure is. Yeah. We were in this town on the eastern border where everyone's super sketchy. <clears throat> A treasure chest. I can hardly wait to open it. Frank's robbing them all. The perfect crime. Hmm. Do you reckon you can go up there? You know, I'm thinking about, and I know I say this every stream, but I'm thinking about... Corpse will serve us well. Frank, shut up. I'm thinking about trying out another class. I don't know, though. Mage is really good. Time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? Frank, shut your effing mouth. Um... It's night time. So we're supposed to be looking for proof of the Sovereign being a fraud or whatever. And I think that means we've got to make someone lie, because... Hey there are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Yeah. Frank always wants to wager that there's useful ingredients. I'm not sure it's a good bet. <clears throat> Most of the ingredients are useless, if anything. The stairs that follow our every move mark this as no ordinary village. I know, Frank. I know. Hmm. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I think we need to make someone lie, because... I don't really want to make someone here lie, because they're all jerks. This letter is as suspicious as they come. We must find someone who can explain its true meaning. Alright, Frank. Let me read the letter first. Let's not jump to conclusions. <clears throat> An anonymous letter that bears the phrase, a piece of brass. Okay, let's jump to conclusions. Mm -mm -mm. We're actually going to sleep. As quiet as a milk this is the inn. We've room for course. This Nothing is free the inn. in this world. I have no issue falling asleep, even at... Oh, Frank, you're a character. Oh, nice. Plenty of people using Frank. You've received equipment from an Arisen in another world. Equip it now? Sure. Has someone been buffing up Frank? Winter's Path. Who's been buffing Frank? Without my permission.
Um. <clears throat> Frank, can you just keep killing drakes? I'll give you... Oh look, a noon bloom. We need those. <clears throat> I'll give away... a mundane camping kit. You'll not believe the journey I've had! Frank, what equipment have people been giving you? Is that a new robe? Cool. Someone gave Frank a robe. A good sleep does wonders. <clears throat> I'm done with that. Let's go ask this goofball about the letter. A piece of brass. A piece of brass. What could it mean? Also, what else is going on here? I feel like there must be something. Uh, uh. We're off to a cracking start. Hey, look, Zeke's stuck. We actually are off to a cracking start. Don't mind if I do. Said, don't mind if I do. Last. I thought we'd never find one. I thought we'd never find one. Is that all there was there? Frank's killing rabbits. Ah, a material. Useful things, these. Ah, a material. Blah, blah, blah. Um, hmm. Secrets? Hmm. Ooh, that's a little bit sus, Unless isn't it? Is that a cave? Deceive me. There's something down there. I know, Frank. Don't worry, I'm on it. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? No, Frank. Because every time I get you to show me the way, you just kill yourself. It's a sad fact, but that's what happens every time. Also, I'm pretty sure it's down here on that boat. Come to think of it, shall we enlist a warrior to lend us their strength? Oh, Frank started asking for warriors now. It's moving up in the world. Also, no. Secrets? Got rats. Ooh, I can't wait to find out what's inside. Oh, we're here. I know where we are. The impenetrable cliff. Damn it. Now I need to go all the way back around. Hopefully the monsters didn't respawn. Da -da. Hmm. Oh. Whew. 
monsters. It was just a pig. Whew, can never be too sure, uh, too safe. Look, master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Where? Oh yeah. Good eye, Frank. A crappy wooden treasure chest. Hmm. At last! The moment I've been waiting for. Allow me to gather these up. Yoink. <clears throat> uh, this is the right way. Hello, Mr. Tools. <clears throat> the journey begins indeed. Right, let's see. <clears throat> I got distracted there. Now I'm going to throw this chicken at this person. Ah, uh, damn it. <clears throat> it's a simple life. <clears throat> Let's go ask that guy about the note we found. Fancy a look at my words? Fancy a look at my words? He's in a town full of thieves. I'm not sure he's going to get much business. <laughs> Hello there, Geralt. Is there aught else you care to ask? I've always got aught I'd like to ask. Tell me about brass. Beg pardon? Why would you ask such a thing? A letter. Oh, you've made quite the discovery. Yeah. Brass means imitating someone in Thieves' Cant. This letter means to say someone's taken on such a request. Mm. Naturally, I can say nothing as to the who or what of the arrangement. I'm sure you understand. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? Aye. Take care, then. You learn the meaning of brass. Yeah. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? Let's go ask the lady in the inn about brass. She seemed knowledgeable. Ah, you must be the visitor I've heard some <laughs> as you like, sir. I can't. Hmm. 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 Yeah? What is it? Just robbing you, Lapac. I'm taking your dried fish, and there's nothing you can do about it. Frank, what are you doing? Yoink. So we learned the meaning of the word well, brass. Uh, How does that help us? Oh, you need of me. Oh, you need of me. If you're curious, why not ask my lord yourself? I have asked my lord myself. Well met, sir. How might I be of service? <clears throat> that guy's name is really mundane. Do come again. Well, it takes two to make a sale. And this seller had nothing to tempt us with. Our funds are better spent elsewhere. Can't say I have any tidings to share. I already looted this house. What brings you here? Shh. 
Um, I feel like I've explored everything. <clears throat> but I clearly have. I'm in no mood for a chinwag, thank you. <laughs> now this is a good find. Yeah. Don't think I've ever been in here. How goes it? Have you found Fulminus Shield, the magic Aegis? Oh, oh right. dear. <clears throat> Still haven't no, found it. Chill out, Wendy. I do have Fulminus Shield. I totally forgot about your quest. <clears throat> I've got all the Fulminus Shields. I've got Fulminus Shields out the wazoo. Well met. This is the of course. Nothing's free in this world. Nothing's free in this world. Yeah, I don't know. Some stuff is. Um, Fulminous Shield. Fulminous Shield. Shit, maybe I don't have Fulminous Shield. I've got Fulgurus Lord. Oh, I've already got a Howling Blizzard. Glad to be of service, sir. Uh, I legitimately have no idea what I'm doing here. Um, uncover what you can of the false sovereign's origins. Well, we know that brass means to be hired to impersonate someone. And this says, a piece of brass. But nobody will speak to us about it. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure the game wants me to make someone in town like me. But, uh... I don't really want to do that. Geralt of Rivia, have you got anything to say? Don't bring trouble to my door, you hear? Yeah, I hear. Can't say I have any tidings to share. This never used to be open. I know it did. Hmm. I'm stuck. Je suis not sure. Nothing on the roof. Hey, did Frank just catch me? That's awesome. Uh, maybe I do need to make someone like us. If they sell flowers in the shop, that's definitely what we need to do. Must you run so fast? I can hardly keep you in my sights arisen. Do they sell flowers in the shop? What brings you here? Oh. Well met, sir. No. How might I be of service? Um, I don't know. Do you want? A beast skin. How odd. All right. Hail. I have my beast skin back. I 
feel like this quest needs to give me more details. <clears throat> Try doing to someone else what I just did to you, the woman tailing you. I need to tail someone. Search of Dara's home. Dara. Dara. The hell is Dara? Oh, Dara? Do I need to tail you? Who even is Dara? Yeah? What is it? You're not Dara. Are you Dara? Hmm. Can't say I have any tidings to sh I clearly need to stalk this Dara person. Look at my what brings you here? What brings you here? He's called Mundane. If you're curious, why not ask Dara? Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I don't recall a Dara. Ah, you must be the visitor. <laughs> As you like, sir. This is the inn, of course. Nothing's free in this world. Glad Top to be of service. Tree. Dara, Dara, Dara. If I was Dara, where would I be? How goes it? Have you found? Oh dear. Still haven't found it. Shut up, Wendy. <clears throat> I'm on important business. Dara. There is no one called Dara here. That's why I think maybe we just need to like find a hidden cave or something. Because if we're supposed to follow someone, that means logically they must go somewhere. Ergo, there is somewhere. For Let us me be to the go. one to collect it. It's logic 101, isn't it? So the question is, where the hell does Dara go? you go along here? <coughs> oh, so in it, brov. Word. Dara's not going to be doing any parkour. Where are you, Dara? If I were to give you I have a hefty wager riding on you, cuz. Are you Dara? You best go else. There's no business. No, to be that's had here. Snail. That's for sure. <clears throat> I feel like there has to be a cave. And Dara goes to the cave. <clears throat> and the cave is full of secrets. Frank, what are you doing?
Thing is, there's nobody in the town called Dara. So they must have already gone. I really feel like I've explored everywhere. <clears throat> That was wishful thinking. Tis no more or less than what one might have expected. Uh -huh. <clears throat> At least I got that seeker's coin. <clears throat> Hidden path. Hidden cave. Hidden something. Maybe we need to wait till night time. Oh my god. <laughs> I could believe that we have to wait till night time. Are you Dara? I have a modest talent for spotting materials that can be... I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your... Hey, look, chest. Have I never been here? It's here. Does she have a modest ought? Probably not. Ought catches the light. I think Frank's been killing rabbits. I think it has to be a cave. It has to be. But it might only show up... <clears throat> like, it might be like open sesame, you know? Like, it doesn't open until the NPC goes there. In order to stop exactly what I'm trying to do now. I think for sure we need to follow this Dara person. For sure. Dara? <clears throat> no, this is that lady who's like, oh, have you found the book yet? It's Wendy. There is no Dara. And there is no Queen of England. Right, let's rest it. Let's rest until it's night. Frank's gonna kill the Easter Bunny. Yeah. Probably. This is, of course. Nothing's free in this world. There are worse things than. <clears throat> I think Dara's gonna be around at night, or gonna go at night. One of the two. Aha! Uh -huh. Great. It was just as daunting to battle Cyclopes. Cyclopes. Now, but we mustn't let that dim our spirits.
Are you Dara? If you cute. Yeah? What is it? Why is everyone standing out in the open? It's night time. I wish I could remember where I found that thing, because that would have been Dara's house. Where I found the note. And I feel like if I'm going to tail Dara, knowing which is his house, it's probably a good idea. Frank, have you got any lantern oil? This is part of the main quest, yeah. Dara. Dara, Dara, Dara. The life out of me. Is there aught else you care to ask? I take care. There is no Dara. Dara's a myth. Scared the life out of me. Hmm. I think. <clears throat> Maybe I'm supposed to sneak up on these guys. Where are they going? Why are they going to see the nobleman in the middle of the night? This is for you, Master. Frank, keep it down. I thought it might come in useful. They're trying to be stealthy and ought. You turds, you're just going to stand there, aren't you? What's all this about? There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Wait, 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 wait. If you must go off on your own, there's naught to be done. I only hope you'll How did I miss this? Rather than later. Uh, and I didn't bring any lantern oil. Looks like they've got me covered with these torches. Damn it, where's Frank? I guess Frank's refusing to come. Don't give me no physics-based puzzle. Great, you gotta look at his G-string. Oh, I could make oil, that's a good shout. <sighs> Look. 
Look, game. I got no time for your wacky ass puzzle. <laughs> Everything we did not want to see, yeah, totally. Also, I do have time for this puzzle, there might be a secret on it. Secret? No. God, imagine not being a mage and having to do that legitimately. Doesn't bear thinking about. Yunk. <laughs> At least it's gonna still have it in the scabbard, yeah that's true. Secrets? Or am I just gonna cheese this one as well? Well, 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 if it isn't Geralt of Rivia... You made it after all. Oh. He's in the background, I didn't mean this guy. Guess that means I win. Oi, you lot best pay up. Dear me. Look, it's Geralt. I mean, he's not doing too well. You're the one then. Fine. I'd hoped I'd not be seeing you here. How dare you? Thank you, sir. Not half bad! Not half bad. I don't understand what the objective here was. Maybe it'll all become clear when I step through this door. To steal all their loot. I can live with that. <laughs> yeah, Geralt did have a headache. I feel like I've missed something here. <clears throat> you didn't disappoint, did you? You've done well. Seems only fair I answer any questions weighing on you. Go on. Ask away. Um. What is this place? What can I say? Not many people bother with this place. Luckily for me, you were different. Knew I was right to bet in favor of the Arisen. Anyway. Most visitors get fooled into going up to the manor. But I did get fooled into going up to the manor. That was like the first thing I did. We send them packing with a trifle, and if they don't question it, good riddance. Anyone that complacent has got no business being a thief. We only train the rare few who make it here. Some might go so far as to say that the entire village was built around this spot. That all you wanted to ask? 
Wow, Geralt really has drank too many potions. That cat in the background just keeps applauding non-stop. <clears throat> Go on then, tell me about the decoy sovereign. Figures you'd want to know about him. We're supposed to be neutral. Ordinarily, I wouldn't say a word about one of our jobs. But I suppose I can tell you the situation being what is. What with you being the lawful ruler of the world? His real name is Dara. He was one of us once. Oh, no wonder I couldn't find Dara. But he's been exiled. We had no choice, see? After he went off to play the false arisen, we're men and women of shadow. Center stage isn't our place to stand. That's why he was cast out. He'll near be part of our village again. That all you wanted to ask? Yeah. Wait, I can do it again. For all this, Dara was in line to become the next thief, Maester. But he failed. Took a massive injury to the chest during the trial. So the title fell to me. That's when he went off, saying he used the scar in his chest to pose as the Arisen. And what a scheme that turned out to be, eh? Now he gets to sit pretty on the best seat in the kingdom. Still, you'd have a hard time proving that he's not who he says he is. He's a wily one, that Dara. Always was careful not to leave behind a shred of evidence. Yeah, but that's fine. We don't have to prove that he's not who he says he is. We just have to prove that we are the one that we say we are, right? We don't have to prove that he's not the Arisen, if we can prove that we are the Arisen. <clears throat> Surely by default that counts as proof. But we can't have him thinking that he gets to go off and enjoy a peaceful life in the lap of luxury after breaking our code. Me thinks he needs something to remind him of the debt he owes us. Here, this should do the trick. Now, as to the Maester's teaching, not sure you'll be able to use it to its fullest potential, but I'll show it to you. I already got it, Srail, off that guy upstairs. Oh wait, this is different. Pilferer's Handbook. <clears throat> cool, I guess. Sorry. I made a mistake. <clears throat> or did I? No one crosses the shadow thieves and dies. This guy's strong. He can dodge my lightning. Ah. 
Alright, peace. Sorry about that, friends. Seems my day. Don't I need him for when I arrest Dara? I don't think so. He's a thief, Where did right? Where you go, Master? It was dreadful lonesome without you. I don't need no stinking thief. A reward You've been listening to Frank too much. I expect Captain Brant will know how to put what we've gleaned to good use. We don't need no thief I in our ranks. Captain Brant will want to hear of this. Leave this to me, Master. I'll bring you straight to the one you seek. <laughs> Why's that child got daggers? <laughs> Only an archer or a sorcerer. Yeah. Right. Just follow me. Okay, Frank. Oh, they unblocked the road. Cool. They did that fast. But of course. Now I know exactly where we are. We've been here before, haven't we? Yes, Frank, we have. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I want to kill that mad ghost. Remember the mad ghost from yesterday? Are you mental? This brute has quite the temper. Our incandescent flame spell and will overwhelm our bow without the fine magics. Feast your eyes on this. Quick, push him, Frank. God, is that the Uber Ghost? Alright. I forgot about the Cyclops. Now, where's that uber ghost? I saw him. I'm sure I saw him. Where was he? I 
think he was over there. Could you come over here? What? I saw the uber ghost, I'm sure I did. Maybe it wasn't the Uber Ghost. Maybe it was just those guys. <clears throat> okay, let's go to town. I'm not using a fairy stone. You literally can't go one second without some pathetic enemy thinking that they're going to take you down. Huzzah! I'll find the Uber Ghost one day. Well, there's no fix to this in a hurry. Better we take the long way round than waste our time gawking at it. <clears throat> I thought that was a pawn. I was totally ready to throw him off a cliff. But it was just a guy. Uber Ghost will be mine. Hey, bandits. I'm going to enjoy this. Go on, run. I says uber ghost were they drivers who failed to get paid and now bought this video game yeah maybe it was this totally badass ghost i don't know how best to describe it other than the uber ghost
It was holding like a banshee's head as a shield. And it could teleport around. It was really cool. But I can't remember where I met it. Slimes, master. Slimes? What? Those harpies. I'll gather these now. It would be a shame to forget their location when we need them most. Yes, Frank. Believe it or not, I have been harmed. Thank you, Master. I feel he was way more powerful than now. the Lich in the Cave. I've actually killed another one of those Lich in the Caves. Griffin, don't be a coward of one this time. not found the Mage Meister yet. It's on my list of things to do. Damn, Frank's wrecking that thing while I'm busy with this one goblin. Uh, I have killed a dragon, yeah. I've killed two dragons. Burn it.
know, I need to get myself a fire spell. Frank's absolutely killing it with fire spells. Who's this guy? I did say that yesterday. It's just I don't want to sacrifice either of my current spells for that. But I'd probably sacrifice the lightning. I could even sacrifice the light, I suppose. Turns out the Mage Blast when he's uh, knocked out is uh, pretty damn good. What happens when I need the Lightning Spell? Yeah. I don't think I've found anyone who exclusively gets hurt by Lightning yet. The Golems exclusively get hurt by Frost. So I'd definitely be keeping that. Plus it's my bread and butter spell. No oozes get hurt by frost. Did he just pick up Frank? Good luck, Frank. Don't run away, Griffin. To have come through unscathed. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh, right in the A face. A forgotten rift stone we've not discovered lies nearby. Tis this way, as I recall, from my last sojourn beyond the rift. We did it. Killed a griffin, not at his base camp. I'm really happy about that. Normally they run away. I heard a rumor that this land was once a kingdom of beastrons. Don't believe everything you hear, Frank. While we're here, shall we take care of that other task we were entrusted with as well? Yeah, we will. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Hello, Mildred. Good tidings, friend. How have you been keeping? As for me, I made the most of my week-long sojourn. One might even say I enjoyed myself over much. You see, I grew so fond of the destination my feet carried me off to, methinks I should like to live there. And that's when I thought, 
Mayhap you've grown just as fond of this dwelling. Fond enough to purchase it from me? It was all an elaborate selling technique. She didn't go anywhere, I bet. I can't just give it to you, mind. I've my relocation costs to consider, but I'd sell it to you cheap as I can afford. She's just a really good real estate agent. This is her unique angle on selling. Well, friend, what say you? Yeah, go on then. Much obliged, friend. I hope you're as pleased with our deal as I am. This little dwelling's all yours now. Suppose I'd best be off. I've my own home to get to. I hope you'll be happy here, friend. Farewell. Farewell, Mildred. Actually, we need to wait until night. I have no issue falling asleep, even at this time of day. Many a time did I rescue the Arisen from a tight spot. Yeah, sounds about right. <clears throat> you know, when I first oh, logged on tis a relief to be and rested. Tis an odd thing to wake after the sun has fallen. Uh, it said someone else had given my Frank uh, some equipment. And I checked, and Frank was wearing a better jacket. So that's pretty cool. I got like a free upgrade for Frank. Here already, are we? Hey buddy. You gave Frank a new ring? I don't think I got that. It was probably worse than what he was wearing. <laughs> it didn't say I got a ring. Then again, I can't remember what rings I'd given Frank. Maybe it did do that. And I just didn't notice. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen your majesty's Oh, you haven't sent him back yet. As a true arisen. I figured out about the false sovereign, Brant. Have you divined aught of the false sovereign, your majesty? Yeah. Here's a bill of arrest. <clears throat> it's kind of weird. A thief gave me it, so I'm not sure how valid it is. This appears to be a bill calling for the arrest of a man named Dara. But hold a moment. Does this man's countenance not bear an uncanny resemblance to that of the false sovereign? I don't know, Brant. I've never seen the guy. Hmm. I see. If your majesty is certain that the two are one and the same, then I am convinced as well. However, I'm afraid this paper alone does not constitute sufficient proof. Ah, but of course... I surmise your majesty intends to post the bill and invite suspicion. Totally. That's exactly what I planned to do. A clever plan. <clears throat> the Queen Regent will be forced to deny any connection to our new sovereign, yet will be unable to remove the bill from the public eye. Furthermore, it will serve as an attestation to Dara's existence, which shall remain an undeniable truth till the man resurfaces, and all the while, the doubts lurking in the hearts of the citizenry will continue to deepen. Yeah, it's a pretty good plan. I'm glad I thought of it. A clever ploy, indeed. I shall attend to this matter personally. I have no doubt that this bill would prove its worth in due course. You have my gratitude, Your Majesty. Your aid has been invaluable. That yeah. thief maesters a capable sort. I'd wager this will make life rather difficult for the Queen Regent. Yeah, maybe Shall it will. we seek out the young man from the other day? I Look, can Frank, guide you there if you wish. This quest is bugged out. I hate to tell you that, Frank, but it is bugged out. We already met the guy. And he walked off. And then I threw him in the river, and the quest never completed. Fancy a little more ways. 
<coughs> Which just goes to show, you shouldn't throw everyone you meet in the river. Sometimes it'll bog out a quest. These writings could be of import. Um, right, what else did we have? That guy wanted to train the bow. Uh, apparently someone's shadowing our step. Slip into the palace through the rear gate. Let's do that one. Onward to Burnworth Castle. an eventful journey, <laughs> but we made it here all right. We cannot accompany you there. You are the Arisen, yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me. Follow me. What if I don't follow you? A welcome respite from all that hustle and bustle. So, you've come. Captain Brandt bade me allow you passage. Okay. <clears throat> I feel like Captain Brandt's the true hero of this story. Where would we be without Captain Brandt? I thought this was going to be like a sneaking section. I guess it was. What do I ever do to you? Have courage! I'm right here beside you! Okay, I will. Thanks for the pep talk. Way too many guys. That's enough. Get up. No. Unacceptable. How could I? My only God is good. If you perform dubious deeds in cities. You may find yourself surrounded by the guard. Oh, they didn't put us in the broken jail cell. Where's my loot? I mean, my gear.
Good thing they didn't check my prison wallet for the key. You know, I was just thinking that. <clears throat> we took literally everything we had except the key to the jail cell. You've had enough? How do you think I feel? I wish I had a staff. feel like a fair fight. I do not consent! Oh, I'm a sovereign citizen, or whatever. I'm unsure how best to <laughs> For real though, where's my gear? Gear. Oh, we sold that stuff. <laughs> Maybe they don't care which jail cell I'm in. I do wonder where my loot is. <laughs> Nothing suspicious. No, I'm in, I'm, in, I'm in my cell. Well, I'm in a cell. God damn it. Throwing the vase at the guards, not them out. That's a good question. The best quality of soldiers now. I've not trained for this. Did 
he die? Couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. <sighs> they always escalate it. Here I am using my fists, and they just whip out a knife. Boy, that's not on. Boy, that's not on, murdering folk. I reckon that person's still dead. Sorry about that. Where the hell is my gear though? It must be down here. But it's not down here. Imagine if I lost all my gear. That's true, we did get a new vase as well. Like it or not, I must go where duty calls me. Oh, come on, dude. Show leniency, I'm a first time offender. This can't be how it is. I don't think my loot is in that place, you know. Take me to prison. This will not go unpunished. Come on, guys. It's a fair cop. Take me in. We're done for. Oh, all's lost. <laughs> Shit. Courage. I'm right here beside you. They figured it out. Falter not! Victory is ours for the taking! Hidden in the bush. Yeah. Oh my god! I'm already arrested, guys! This is police brutality! Police brutality! Stop him! He's resisting arrest! This 
They're all coming to have a turn. That guy's shit. This battle is not yet done. No. Not much going on. It's that kind of attitude that allows this to happen, the guy in the red shirt. Hold fast. You have the strength to play. No more. I don't like this at all. Stand strong. Well, I mean, can you just arrest me, please? The prisoner been beaten? No, he tripped in his cell. Yeah, totally. <coughs> right, this time... I don't know where our save game's gonna be. It's probably when we're in prison. Which is fine, except I don't know where we got our equipment from. It must be somewhere. Maybe it's in a different building. Because I've checked every room in this place. I assumed it'd be next to the cells, but maybe they have like a separate building where they keep the equipment. That'd make sense. Oh, we just get given it back when we leave. if that guy's still dead. I could re-equip, but I think we're going to get captured again, so... Have you come to release me from this jail? Who are you? Um, I'm the Arisen. No. Uh -huh. Then we are presented with three options. Either the law of our world that allows only one Arisen has been upended, or Deezer's Arisen is false, or you are lying to me. Or... D says Arisen is false, and I'm lying to you. Or, D says Arisen is false, and there can be two Arisen. Or, I'm lying to you, and there can be two Arisen. Or, D says Arisen is false, there can be two Arisen, and I'm lying to you. Can be way more than three options, dude. Have you proof? That you are arisen, as you say. Uh, I mean, I'm letting you out of jail, man. I don't know why you're being such ah, a bitch about it. They say the arisen's breast bears a wound akin to the dragon's claw. I don't want to be rescued from prison, unless you're really the arisen. 
By that mark, to seem tis true. This reminds me of a happening 148 years ago. During the reign of Regent Alphonse, a man named Crusoe appeared and claimed to be arisen. That's cool, Walder, but we should probably get out of here. He went before the people, insisting that he, and not Regent Alphonse, was the true arisen, the one fit to lead them as their ruler. And what befell him, you ask? No, I don't. Ha! Crusoe was discovered to be a liar. Whereupon his head was liberated from his shoulders on the spot. Aye, I dare say your arrival portends another beheading, but whose will it be, hmm? Look, let's just escape. Escape? But why? Here, I spend my days perusing the code and deciphering old texts. I can devote all my time to my own interests. And I need not turn my ear to Deesa's <coughs> absurd demands. Tis a paradise to me, this cell. That said, if you know of a place with a mountain of tomes I could delve into, I might rethink the matter. Tell me, does that ring any bells? Uh. I suspected as much. Then we are done here. Leave me be. Can't pick him up. I do want to find a place with plenty of tomes. Now we can re-equip. place to quench his thirst for knowledge. I want to find that anyway. I think it's going to be in here. I can feel it in my proverbial bones. So, uh, let's go. Oh, chill out. Mayhap I'll come here when I have a day to miss. Heavens for Fen! Now's your chance! Heavens for Fen! Rally! You have naught to fear! Absolutely infeasible. Don't make me kill you, guard. Master. Oh, hey, Frank. <clears throat> need healing. I'm happy to oblige. Well, yeah, Frank. Funnily Hold enough, on. I do need healing. Stay right there. Because, uh, while you decided to go off and gallivant around or whatever you were doing, I got the shit kicked out of me repeatedly by the prison guards. It was honestly mildly embarrassing. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll What's this? Come to admire my sculptures, have you? Uh 
Ho, ho. To think my eminence as a collector would reach in the ears of the Arisen. Keep it down, dude. Nobody knows I'm the Arisen. If only my collection were complete, I'd fain allow you to inspect it. Alas, the sculpture that I commissioned to be its centerpiece is yet to arrive. And would wound my pride to have you behold my collection ere it is made whole. If your curiosity shall not be denied, however, mayhap you'd consider paying a visit to the sculptor in my stead. The man's home is located in Bak Batal. You need only tell him that I eagerly await the sculpture's completion. He doesn't what actually sculpt stuff. Information? He's a fraud. If it is an obscure text we seek, methinks Magistrate Waldar is our best hope. His knowledge of tomes is unparalleled. Oh, yeah. I know where that person can be found, Master. This way. Chill out, Frank. I'm uh, just in the process of robbing this guy blind. I see. I've heard some interesting tidings about town. Uh huh. <clears throat> if you must go off on your own, there's naught to be done. I only hope you'll return sooner rather than later. I guess I need to speak to the Magistrate again. When battling monsters, the basic strategy is to overpower them with superior No, superior numbers are a lame strategy. Superior skills are the better one. Oh, Magistrate Walder. I like how the magistrate, the lawman, is like, I don't mind being imprisoned for a crime I didn't commit. It's actually okay. I'm alright with it. Oh! <clears throat> On the hunt for the grimoire entitled Towering Earth, are you? Yes. One moment. Here it is. Towering Earth, the Forsaken Text. I guess he's got a better prison wallet than we have. You can fit a book in his. Ah, uh, you may take it. I can cast no magics myself, after all. Left in my care, tis as a pearl before swine. Not to mention, I've already read it. Thanks, man. I've been looking for that book for literally like 20 hours. <clears throat> yeah, you just need Frank and perhaps an archer. Exactly. Da 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 da. I think I've got all the books now for that kid. <clears throat> Maybe that kid is the mage trainer. This grimoire's for sale near Miss Trisha's abode, according to the list. I have an idea of which shop she might have meant. It'd be kind of weird if a child was the mage trainer. But this is the most magey quest I've had so far. Can I read the tome I've just received? Yeah, but I think it's a one, one and done. Actually, I don't know if I can. Um, <clears throat> Reading it casts a spell, High Sizem. 
yeah, so I think it's a consumable. Pray, slow your feet. You run too fast for the likes of me. You. Yeah. What? You. Yeah. Huh. Hey, is that Pikachu? It is. It's our old friend Pikachu. Never did I dream you would grow so mighty, Arisen. You're a sight to behold. Yeah. For old times' sake, Pikachu. For old times' sake. At last. The moment I've been waiting for. Allow me to gather these up. You. Why'd you keep seeing you? Huh. Uh. <laughs> yeah, just keep banging his head off the stairs. What could go wrong? My, my. I'm trapped like a rat in a cage. This arisen's both shrewd and fleet of foot. Oh, this is the guy following us. Who are you? Oh, Tis obvious, no? No. I am an agent, of a sort. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over, now you've found me out. So, how about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further. Ah, uh, no. Understandable. Still, no harm in asking, was there? Let's get this over with then. Frank, save me! Feast your eyes on this! Guards, guards, I'm under attack! What? Guards! The guards are on his side! Am I the only one getting knocked about? You there! Halt! Brant, chill out, man. Shit! We're in for it now. Why? With all likelihood, he is an agent dispatched from Batal. Nice. Pray, let us handle the rest. We will hear all he has to say before the week is out. I bid you, wait till then. All right, Brant, I thought I was in trouble there for yes, sir. icing that guard. Ugh. We shall see. It'll do you no good letting me rot in here, you know. Another agent will be on you before long. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> oh, dear. Mm-hmm. Right, we're gonna go to uh a kid. But we're gonna stop off in Merv along the way. Where am I on this map? <clears throat> no, no, I was just telling him to chill. Ah, a material. Yeah, totally. Useful things, these. Ah, a material. Uh, should we take the ox cart? Yeah. I'm not taking any passengers just now, sir. I 
see. God damn it. This ox cart's bound for me. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Deal. <clears throat> dee dee dee. Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? Come on, let's go. It's been a hard day. Off we trot. It's been a hard day. So long, I almost forgot why I came. It's been a hard day. It's been a hard day. Surely I'm overdue a day off. It's been a hard day. Bones. This game could really benefit from like full on oblivion dialogue. The NPCs have got like three phrases they say. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Been a hard day. No ambush, no ambush, no ambush. Yeah, I am pretty great. I'll harvest what day. I can, should it please you. I need some noon flowers. My patience wears thin. Was a bumpy ride, but we've arrived all the same. Why are these guys so freaked out? Repel the dragon. Well, that explains it. All right, guys, let's do this. That damn dragon! Hurry, everyone, get yourselves to safety. I'll repel this dragon, all right. It's like a real dragon. Myself. There you are. Look NPCs, I don't mean to be that guy, but I don't actually need you. You leave. Hey, what's that mage casting? That's a cool spell. Oh, 
ごいよ、ね。Guys, <clears throat> kick him when he's down. Better run. Why oh, is that question gonna attack? That'd be awesome. What was that? The beast is reactionary, lashing out when attacked. Might we not use this to our advantage? Show yourself. What? Twas a lesson in determination. Somehow I knew you'd come. Yeah. You have my gratitude as well, sir. Ulrika, glad I am to see you unharmed. You must return to the village. Everyone is concerned for you. We could have totally killed that dragon. Forgive me. I'd best go. But I shan't forget this. Thank you. Truly. Mm. Think it was this guy casting those spells. Leave the finding of equipment enhancing materials to me, Master. I shall sniff them out and mark them on your map. <clears throat> um, it says he's a thief. No, wait. The Arisen's a thief. He's a sorcerer. Summons meteors. Takes forever to cast. Pretty OP. But I'm sure someone was casting a protective spell. Who could it have been? Such quietude is a blessing. You shouldn't say that kind of shit with me around, dude. Oh shit, did that aggro him? What? That doesn't usually happen. One ill tight dodge, and I'm covered in bruises. Usually they take it like a champ. I'll make the pain go away. Hold on, stay right there. Ah, he was a nameless dude. <sighs> right, we're looking for the shop. What class am I playing? Uh, mage. This ladder can take us to new heights. Fancy look at my wares. 
No, you don't have the thing that I want. Do come again. Hmm. I said there was a shopkeeper who sold. They said they said it was near near the lady's house, right? <clears throat> she lives up here. What shop would be near there? I guess we'll head up there. There must be a shop kicking about, I guess. Like a random wilderness shop. Doesn't sound feasible, but it must be true. Master, if you're carrying around anything you don't need, there's no time like the present to rid yourself of it. Yeah. The creature's corpse say. will serve us well. Killing pigs, are you fine? I know precisely when a curative is needed, Master. You're That's fortunate. <clears throat> Right, we're looking for a shopkeeper in the wilderness. I also still haven't got into that mysterious cave. The one up there. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? Uh, yeah, go on then, Frank. That does ring a bell. <clears throat> Let me think. Ha! I'm pretty sure we got, got all the treasure it. chests. I know are you just going to jump off Follow cliff? Me. Here already, are we? Normally when Frank's like, oh, I know where there's a treasure chest, I go, go on then, show me. And he leaps off a cliff and dies. Not this time, though. Time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? Hmm, a shopkeeper. Goblins approach. We're already nearly at the house. My magics are at your disposal. you've somewhere else in mind you'd rather go. If you've no need of my guidance, by all means, lead the way. No, no, Frank, I think I do have need of your guidance. This grimoire's for sale near Miss Trisha's abode, according to the list. I've an idea of which shop she might have meant. Okay. I can guide you there if you wish. Please do, because <clears throat> I'm sure I checked all the shops in town. Hmm. 
There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Maybe there is another shop there that I missed. Come to think of it, shall we enlist a warrior to lend us their strength? No. Our road was a long one. Oh, this guy. But here we are at. I've a selection of wares that sure. Frank, <clears throat> I hate to break it to you, man. But he doesn't sell the book we need. A fulminous shield, eh? I picked it up in Mel. Can't speak for its contents, but it's certainly... Actually, maybe that is the one we need. Hang on. <clears throat> I was thinking of a uh, towering earth, but we've already got that one. Let's go to the inn. at the inn, well, I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. But enough about me. <laughs> oh, that's all that prison garb. I need to give Frank some lantern oil. But enough about Frank. At me? Did you need something? Um. Always a pleasure. All right, let's have a look. Wow, I've got a lot of current quests. <clears throat> Let there be light. Fulminous shield. Nation's death knell. Howling blizzard. Towering earth. One, two, three, four, five. Five books. Let there be light. Fulminous shield. Nation's death knell. Howling blizzard. Towering Earth. Nice. <clears throat> Be in the mood for a song, it does. Uh, let's rest. Might as well. Here at the inn, we all get so few customers, you see, that but I can manage both me. roles myself. But enough about me. Did I have no issue falling asleep, even at... Who's this guy? You'll not believe the journey I've had. Our adventure continues. Hmm. Let's go hand in this quest. It's been a long time coming. Oh yeah. But enough about that guy. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Secrets. Are we taking a load off so soon? We've only just rested. What are you talking about, Frank? I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. That's a shame. <laughs> I wonder if the Cyclops While respawned. While travelling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? Yeah, go on then. I feel like we haven't missed any treasure chests. Days like this make me glad to be alive. Pray give me no more grief. Oh, it's her father. Not allowed uh, her father or mother to be there when we give her the books. That's a stipulation she had in the quest. <sighs> Remember when that guy was the bane of my existence? Is that up there? Is that a Cyclops. It is. Is it fighting uh, that kid's mother? Because the mother hangs out up there. Fighting the mother. Well, this brute has quite the temper. Did he walk her off the cliff? Mother's corpses.
I guess we can look for her on the way back. At least that means the mother's guaranteed not to be home when we hand this quest in. Every cloud has a silver lining. <clears throat> Have you brought me a grimoire, sir? Yeah. Feast your eyes on that. Thank you for all the grimoires, sir. Is that the last of them you'll be bringing? Uh, if you want more, I will. Then you have my gratitude for all you've done. Would that I had a reward for you. But I'm afraid I've little gold of my own. Oh, mayhap this will suffice. Tis a ring my father gave me. Tis only fitting, really. Given he was the one who forbade my studies in the first place. Yeah, screw him over twice in a row. Why not? Go on. Tis no cheap trinket. Now, I'd best take my leave of you. I've my studies to attend to. Uh, Materials yeah. such as this can be combined to craft things. By the way, your mother might be dead. She got thrown off a cliff by a cyclops. Proves the wearer's friendship with Trisha, daughter to a sorcerer of renown. Cool. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Let's go try find the mother. <clears throat> See if we can resurrect her. She got thrown pretty far, I think. Perhaps it is best to live and let live. Gobbo's pretty tough. Guy's a real son of a bitch. Nice. <clears throat> right, we're looking for the mother's corpse. She got thrown this way. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. She got thrown really far. She was thrown like this direction. Ah, is that her? While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? I have a wake stone on me. No. Okay, looks like we're taking her back to town. 
See, I'm not the monster they make me out to be. to resist the urge to throw her over the edge. It's like an impulse. Gets resurrected, inquires about the extra bruises she got. Yeah, I think she'll understand. The last thing she'll remember was being thrown off a cliff by a cyclops. <laughs> oh, the extra bruises. When I threw her off that extra cliff. Yeah, that's fair. I can just say the Cyclops did it. Oh, after you died, he uh, he ragdolled your corpse a bit. I don't know why. Who's to say uh, who's to say why I a Cyclops does anything? There was another matter we were to attend to hereabouts, was there not? Uh, why do I feel like this place is going to get attacked by the dragon as soon as I arrive? Carrying people by that much water and not throwing them in is so unlike me. Yeah, I know. It really is. I feel like the dragon's going to be back. Why do I have to revisit Melv? Right, let's take it to the inn. That gave me a fright. Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? Hopefully, I can resurrect her. Here at the inn, I get so few customers, you see. But enough I can about me. Both roles myself. But enough about me. Wakestone, Wakestone. We've got loads of them at this point. Seventeen. Did you need something? Do come again. I think I heard a dragon. What the? Oh. Oh. Trisha's been rather restless of late. More so than usual, I mean. You wouldn't happen to know what's gotten into her, would you, sir? Yep. Here you are, master. I hope you like it. I found it myself. But snitches get stitches. Right, why did I have to revisit this town? There's literally nothing going on here. Leonard, do you have anything to say? Not much going on. They're still patching up what the dragon tore down. Okay. Melva suffered the dragon's attack twice now. Perhaps you should return to the village from time to time and see how they're getting on. I mean, I did. They don't seem it to care. It strikes me that we have not visited Mel for some time. Shall we stop by and see how its people fare of late? I can guide you there if you wish. Frank, we're literally here. Do be quick. I fear my time is in short supply. Really? Uh, 
I've naught to say to you. Off with you. Jeez. I saved them from a dragon. Twice. Here at the inn, I get so few customers, you see. That In my line of business, patience is key. Always a pleasure. I see life as a journey, to be walked a day at a time. Yeah, that's nice. Um... See how the people are getting on. I'll gather these now. It would be a shame to forget their location when we need them most. What is it? I'm rather busy if you can't tell. I actually can't tell. Pray give me no more grief. Life is for the living, Brett. Uh, yes. Do we Let me alone, I pray you. Only fools devote their lives to t Everyone here's an asshole. Hoy, an odd fellow went into Ulrika's house just now. Might have been a noble. He had a nasty look about him. Really? Ere since the reign of Rathais, the founder of Vermund, the village of Malf has played an indispensable role in the defense of our kingdom against the dragon. Yet twice now, as the dragon set upon this village, inflicting numerous casualties before being allowed to flee. The fault here lies with you, Ser Ulrika. You have failed in your duty as acting chief. With all due respect, Sir Martin, our village has dispatched many of its young hands to the northern stronghold since its completion. Was it not the former consul who decreed that the stronghold should serve to defend the kingdom? With Melv offering aid only where needed? Yeah, you tell him, Ulri, ka 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 ka. Yet the stronghold has remained entirely silent to our plight. How can you say that the fault is ours to bear? I know of no such agreement. At the very least, Queen Regent Deesa has mentioned naught of the kind. But I'm quite sure the consul. You would dare misrepresent the words of the dead? Or do you mean to imply that the Queen Regent has spoken falsely? If so, then Melv's problems ran far deeper than I had thought. Tis not indolence that has taken root here, but treason. The village entire will answer for this. What? I intended nothing of the sort. Pray, let us... Save your honeyed words, traitor. I must inform the Queen Regent of this development. Oh, he despawned. I was going to kill him. Oh, is this him? I'll admit... What is your purpose here? <clears throat> Take a wild guess. <laughs> well, rip that guy, I guess. <clears throat> Problem solved. Go see all the ka 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 ka. Oh, you just got the same haircut. <sighs> you came to see me. Forgive me, I've much to ponder. Still, how would you like to stay the night? Hey! I've yet to repay you for aught you've done for me. A small show of hospitality is surely the least I can do. Yeah. 
It was by your godly efforts that Malv escaped the worst of the dragon's assault. The people of this village are more precious to me than life itself. To lose them would have been the end of me. You have my earnest gratitude, friend. I wanted to tell you that, if not else. Now, it is time we slept. There is much to be done for the village, and I shan't manage it without a good night's sleep. Pow chicka pow wow. I only see one bed. Okay, maybe there's multiple beds. But I don't think she was sleeping on these. These aren't even real beds. I'm pretty sure we banged. I've more than my fair share of troubles, as it is. Nobody likes us. This ladder can take us to new heights. Also, where did she go? Also, I assumed that was what we had to do for this quest. Maybe murdering that guy ruined the quest. Is she? Well met. Looking to make a purchase? Uh, no. <clears throat> Hope to see you again. Nothing caught your eye? Oh, that's a shame. Let's hope there's aught worth our coin next time. Where the hell is she? She just loved us and left us. I mean, I can respect it to a certain extent. But I want my quest log to clear. Ulrika! This will help you back. Why have they suddenly started holding a grudge? Five magics are at your disposal. <laughs> Don't kill him, Frank. Where's Ulrika? I'm regretting throwing that guy off the cliff. Is she dead? No. Away with you. Nobody likes us. Let me think of this. Maybe if I wait until night, she'll show up. I'm thinking about reloading our last in save, though. But I don't know when that was. I think it was a while back. Was it before or after the ring quest? I think it was before, right? I don't understand what they want me to do in this town. Ah! 
cheek of you! I'd best slip and duck around before I open up the You need me at the vanguard? Say no more! No, Frank, I need you to tell me what to do on this quest. I've looked everywhere. How are you doing, Lennart? Whatever I'm at to do. For the record, he brought it on himself. Sort of. What if I... No, I can't even resurrect the guy. Unless I go all the way to the capital. Unless his corpse is down here. I don't think it's it is, a ladder. though. Shall we see where it leads? I think I'd have to go all the way to the capital and resin. I guess we can try. The only thing I can think of is that there's supposed to be something that happens between Ulrika and that guy, right? And then she'd be like, boo hoo hoo, blah blah blah, quest quest quest. For some reason, I don't think they predicted that you'd just throw that guy off a cliff after he threatened to murder the village. Apologies, but I can't. <clears throat> I think it was a reasonable thing to do. This ox cart, but I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Oh, the sight of yon ox cart has brought all my fatigue to the fore. Shall we climb aboard? Life is for the living, friend. Yeah. You're in need of a ride. It is now or now. Ding, 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 ding. And before I forget, hesitation bogs you down, but it needn't. Your journey's just begun. No attack, no attack, no attack. Huh? Nice. <laughs> Bring here, out your dead. Shall we take care of that other task we were entrusted <clears throat> with as well? Receive recompense from Sven. I already received recompense. And then I threw him in the river. <laughs> Double recompense? Hi. Faring well, I hope. Would you care to join me? I'd not say no to a bit of company. I was hoping you'd say that. Do you know, I had a feeling we'd meet here today. Intuition, I suppose. Say, you're not from round here, are you? Are you a traveller? Have you seen many places? Yeah. How I envy you. This city is all I know. I long to learn more of the outside world, but... Mother won't allow it. She's always telling me how dangerous it is beyond the palace walls. But that only makes me question her judgment all the more. No, she's right, man. She's right. I don't think you'd survive for five minutes outside the walls. After all, if the world truly <coughs> is so perilous, what of the lives of our people? They must be fraught with uncertainty, subject to harsh conditions. They are! It seems unfair that I alone should be shielded from that reality. But listen to me waffling on. Ah, I almost forgot. I, I happened upon this little curio the other day. Here, you're welcome to it, if you'd like. My apologies, friend, but I'd best be going. 
I mustn't let Mother find out I left the palace. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll see each other anon. Till then, farewell. It's Ben. <clears throat> do you want to see what it's like outside the city? <clears throat> now, I know you guys think I'm just going to throw him in the river, but I'm not. He wants to see what life's like. I heard a rumor that this land was once a kingdom of beastrons. Let's uh, give him an education, eh? Oh, gobbos! This is for giving me a terrible quest reward. Ring of Accrual? What the hell, man? Who needs a Ring of Accrual in this day and age? It's for your own good, Sven. You can just fight to your mother. You can say you were kidnapped. It's the perfect crime. I should tell you, there's a forgotten rift stone nearby. I found it beyond the rift. Shall we go there now? A little bit of excitement for Sven. Sorry, I ran out of stamina. That's my bad. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Good luck, Sven. <clears throat> oh, they're doing him dirty. You're not going to fight him, no? All right, Sven. I'm afraid I must be going now. Thank you again for your aid. You're welcome. Uh, what was I doing in town? Resurrecting that guy. <clears throat> the villain. Griffin, don't eat, Sven. Get off my vegetables. Sven, are you? And before I forget, might we not consider bringing a sorcerer into our party? Where'd he go? Oh well. <clears throat> Maybe decided to work in the fields for a bit. Right, let's go to the graveyard. This way. If memory serves, there is another place we were to visit not far from here. It's up here, I think. Yeah. Oh, I need a wake stone. 
Isn't it about time we had ourselves a meal? Yeah. Oh, what I wouldn't I give for a bowl stuff. of hot stew. Well met. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey. About me. When treated to the there might be other people there. I'll res everyone if there's other dead folk there. God knows how many people have died <clears throat> due to my carelessness. I don't think that many have though. We'll take five, just in case. Won't someone do what about this? Won't someone do what about what? Are you freaking out about the dead guys in the graveyard? I beg pardon, sir, but might I have a moment of your time? Oh, really? I have a proposal to make, and methinks you'll want to hear it. See, a friend of mine has an empty house, but no use for it. And I see you round the inn rather often. Understand me? Wouldn't come free, mind. But the price is a fair one. And you'd have a place to call your own. What say you? I already own a house. Well, you needn't decide this. Oh, maybe that's like in the noble quarter. Because that was way more expensive. Right, I'm not paying five grand to find the corpse. Martin, that was the guy, right? Yeah. The last thing I remember is being thrown into the river. You have my thanks. <clears throat> Anyone else? Some random guy. Some random guy. <clears throat> I wonder if that means that they're not important. Or if it just means I don't know their names. Oscar? Oscar from the Checkpoint Rest Town. Who are you, Oscar? I don't remember murdering an Oscar. Many thanks. Hey, he's a wizard. Maybe I did murder him. Like it or not, I must go where duty calls me. Hmm. Yoink. Wakestone shards are worth their weight in gold when one has enough of them to combine. Is that all the dead guys? Looks like it. <clears throat> I think the rest of them were just question marks. And I feel like question marks aren't important. But, there's only three of them. I've got three wake stones on me. I'll res you, random guy. 
You need to go to Checkpoint Town. Where is it? All the way to the west. You can just take the ox cart from uh, Vermond if you need to. But yeah, it's to the west. Much obliged. Oh, he does have a name, Gibran. Like it or not, I must go where duty calls me. So maybe it's just that I don't know their names. Like I never interacted with them or whatever. I remember killing this guy. My thanks. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That guy had the deepest voice known to man. Uh, I've not seen this. That voice is deep enough to wake the Balrog. <clears throat> right. <clears throat> Let's go to... Well, we need to go back to that town again. Merv. This ladder can take us to new heights. Frank, can you stop talking about that ladder? We've seen it like a million times. We're not taking anyone right now. I've naught to say to you. Come back. Uh, Apologies, but I can't off <sighs> These guys are the worst. Remember I was supposed to be finding that place of learning. That's probably where the mage guy is. This ox cart's bad. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Riding in an ox cart would be a welcome reprieve. Mm. I've got to some My shift's only just mm -hmm. No ambush, no ambush, no ambush. I want to believe. Uh, I did install the patch. And I've not noticed any improvements. Right, hopefully, something happens now. Where is Ulrika? Yes! The Queen Regent has declared that Ulrika be apprehended as a traitor to the kingdom. All who seek to abet her will be tried in turn. Bring her before me at once. Ulrika is gone. What? She stole away in the dead of night. Ask around. Several witnesses can confirm it. I cannot say why for certain, but I imagine she took your words to heart, Overseer. Realizing her plans for rebellion had been found out, she chose to abandon the village for our sake. But she wasn't a re What? You would have me believe that Ulrika was acting alone? That the rest of the villagers harbor no rebellious intent? Aye, that's the long and short of it. Very well. I shall take you at your word, sir. However, the absence of a leader will sow naught but chaos. I'll be the leader. For the time being, your village will be in our hands. Damn it. If tis as you say, I do not expect there will be any objections. <clears throat> Ulrika fled the village after banging us. Ah, you've heard she fled the village. I, though that is the case, she would never truly abandon it. 
She left the village that she might fulfill her charge, protecting Vermont against the dragon. As for where she went, I do not know. Probably north, to the northern whatever. It would be unwise for me to go looking for her, lest I draw the eyes of the overseer's troops. However, should you happen to find her, would you tell me where she is hiding? I can only pray that she does not fall into the Queen Regent's clutches. Yeah, I will. <clears throat> cool. Maybe she went to that guy's house. I've no time for pointless chatter. You're pushing your luck, Martin. Do you reckon he's taking the ox cart back to town? No. Yeah, maybe she went to the guy's house. Ingredients up. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive. Endeavor away. <clears throat> Remember that guy who lives just over here? Maybe she went to hang out with him. He seemed a friendly sort. <clears throat> hey, gobbles. Well met. You couldn't have come at a better time. Really? Word of my dismissal arrived just a few hours past. Oh, he really did get fired. It would seem my time here has reached its end. Can't say I'm happy about it. I'm rather fond of this place. And if you'll remember, this is where you and I first spoke. Is it? Going, are you? Be well, friend. No, you're going. Sir, the Cyclops is coming. I knew this was a boss arena. Didn't I call it instantly? Oh. Push him over. Damn it, nobody helped. Oh, good one, Frank. Hi, 
I, sir. I've been better, as twere, but I'll live, and I expect we all shall. Glad to hear it. Make for the encampment and inform your captain of what happened here. Quickly now. Aye, sir. That went well. Fool glad I am to see you unharmed, my friend. Many thanks for your aid back there. Yeah. Pay Baron another visit before he leaves. I thought he was leaving. Thank heavens. Hey Baron, remember we dueled earlier? Can we have a rematch? Also, what she's not here. You. Oh, I'd not say no to a short repose hereabouts. Impressive. Yeah. Uh, do I still have that quest? Visit Baron's tent in a day or so. Maybe. Oh, we prevailed by the skin of our teeth. Is that a timed quest? No. An abandoned campsite, just waiting to be claimed. Right, we're gonna go and look for that uh, law town. With that in mind, we're actually going to walk uh, back to Vermond. We're not going to take the ox cart. Because I think it's going to be on the way. But let's rest first. We haven't rested in a while. Here at the inn, we, I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But, but enough, enough about, about me. me. Did... Ah, where have you been, Frank? Two likes. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, yes, Noon Bloom. <clears throat> Thanks a lot, Arcano. Oh, tis a relief. I've a feeling fortune shall favor us this day. I hope so, Frank. Weird. I totally disoriented myself. Time to explore. Oh, 
the sight of yon ox cart has brought all my fatigue to the fore. Shall we climb aboard? Nope. I would get on the ox cart if you could choose to, like, get off at a given point. But you can't. Like, if you could put a waypoint halfway to the sea and go, eh, just take me there. God damn it. Mr. Tools says, ox cart is my favourite. I sold my car and I'm buying an ox and a wagon. It's a good idea. You need to watch out for griffins, though. While travelling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? Did you really, Frank? I'm pretty sure I explored this entire place. How might we approach yon spire? <laughs> Maybe treasure chests to respawn. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. All right, Frank, where's this chest? Frank? Right, we're looking for any paths <coughs> off the main road that we haven't explored. We did that dungeon, that was the lizard dungeon. That had the lich at the end? Yeah. Goblins approach! <laughs> Goblins and bandits. Oh, am I the only one getting knocked about? Let's just leave them to it. Hmm. Oh, this is where the earthquake happened.
I never fully explored this place, but there's probably a secret up here. It is no more or less than what one might have expected. I was expecting the Seeker's token. I guess not. Ooh, I can't wait to find out what's inside. I'm getting pretty good at using Levitate to slow my descent. When the Arisen fells the dragon and saved the land, they ascend to the throne as sovereign. Hence, pawns are treated with respect as a matter of course here in Vermont, for their peerless loyalty to the Arisen. Not to mention, they are skilled combatants, willing to brave any foe or peril upon command. Tis clear their concept of life and death differs crucially from our own. No mortal can match their dedication. Thanks for the info, dude. Frank. <clears throat> oh, that's that cave I can't go into. The mysterious cave. But I have a theory about that one actually, and it involves that ruin. to have come through unscathed. I reckon there's going to be a ladder down in here that's going to take us to an underground thingamajig that will lead out uh, over there. You're staring, Arisen. Has aught yonder caught your eye? No. I think I was wrong. But there has to be some way to get in there. Like, look where it is. How else would you get into the Cavern of Forsaken? Oh. I see! <clears throat> Ooh. 
But we did the Cavern of the Forsaken. And it never led us out here. Did it? Maybe it did. I feel like it didn't. That was the Lich place. Yeah, whatever. Might there be aught over there? Free ride. You are mighty indeed, Arisen. They should give me a free ride. You know, that thing only happens once. I've never seen that mechanic used again. Right, check out this cool mechanic. You can break things and water will come down. And it only happens once. He just cracked the griffin in the head.
Griffin Leggett. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Maybe he'll attack us again. <laughs> I've got a good feeling about this one. That ladder looks promising. Uh, which ladder? Oh, look! Good eye, Frank. I'll harvest what I can, should it please you. <laughs> Cabin of the Forsaken? Again? We shall have to crane our legs to spot our foes in a place like this. An ogre! Stand ready! Fire again. Now is our best chance. Hurry. Hey, Ultra.
your cabling. I really thought we fully explored this zone now. Look here! A path! Right. It's safe, I wonder. Never been here. That was impeccably timed, Arisen. I'm sure we did the forsaken Ooh, place. Though. I can't wait to find out what's inside. Are we not overdue some new equipment? Yeah, we are. We're going this way now, I suppose. Ugh, by your will. Where did this bring us out? Down there. So is there a fourth exit? Fourth exit a
like the look of that. Only misery awaits the one game enough to touch it, I fear. What? <clears throat> this should lead us to that one exit. The mystery You're exit. Scared. I hope you weren't expecting the first. Yeah, this is our other exit. But there is another route. So maybe, just maybe, there is a fourth exit. Wherever Frank was like, oh, I wouldn't touch that. What was he talking about? That's the mystery of this cave done at least. It was bothering me that we hadn't explored the whole thing. <laughs> Where are you, Frank? As you wish, I shall return directly. Did anyone else see that? Ort catches the light. Really? Does Ort really catch the light? Oh, it does. At last! I thought we'd never find one. What the hell? What was that? No! The monster's left something for us. Fair enough. <clears throat> right, I kind of want to find a campfire. I the whole point the is... Sky for all eternity. I want to be exploring wasn't for the everything on the way into town. And uh, if it's night time, that's not going not gonna to happen, is it? Need a campfire. Let's not be hasty. Now. I aid you, sir. Cool. Uh, campfire. Secret. At last! The moment I've been waiting for. Allow me to gather these up. Ought catches the light. I 
Aha, campfire. Shall we enlist a warrior to lend us their strength? No, Frank. Oh, we're here. I know where we are. A passage. Here. Truly. There are secrets around every corner. Where? What passage? What are you talking about, Frank? Frank, you can't say the words passage and secret and then not... Tell me where it is. That's classic Frank, that is. That is classic Frank. get franked just imagine the coin we'd gain from selling this I guess he was just talking about this path in general which is vaguely secret I guess isn't there a dragon around here Yeah, we are pretty OP. Isn't there a bandit in here? No? I am aware of that, Deli. <clears throat> I don't like to leverage it too much. <clears throat> Visions of roast meat will dance in my head tonight. For all I've stuffed myself. Finally equipping that fire spell. It's been a long time coming. If tis discipline your company lacks, I can provide. Right. I want to be going... over here. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. 
Perhaps I could show you the way? Methinks I have an idea of where Sir Ulrika might have gone, Master. Really? I know the way. Follow me. My talents lie in combining materials, and I'll use those in my... Over here! Sorry, Frank. I don't know what came over me. Also, Frank was like, oh, I know where there's a treasure chest. And I was like, yeah, okay, show me where it is. And he's like, actually, I'm going to tell you uh, how to do that quest you were on. It's like, Damn it, Frank, that's not what I want. You talked about a treasure chest. Do you want me to slide down? Mind, if I do, I shan't be climbing up again. This yeah, go for it, man. too steep for that. That chest. It seems you've somewhere else in mind you'd rather go. If you've no need of my guidance, by all means, lead the way. Frank is so passive aggressive. That dead Cyclops must have been there for ages. Maybe it's not dead, maybe it's asleep. Uh -huh. Maybe this is a chest Frank was talking about. I think he is dead. I've got a good feeling about this one. He's just a very frank individual. Yeah, very good, Badger. <laughs> Frank, really? Hey look, Orc catches the light. I am grateful to you, Arisen. It says there's caves here. I don't know if I believe that. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. That ogre really is dead. You think they'd have learned from the last lot that we're not to be trifled with. Looks like he was burnt to death. this cave hey a frank stone <clears throat> oh it's broken frank stone they're the worst they're like you yeah, can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need master
let me be the one to collect it. Right, where's this cave? Cave through the mountain. No, not really. Waitstone shards are treasures to be prized, though only when made whole can they work their magic. Look here, a path. Is it safe, I wonder? Frank. <sighs> Alright, I want to explore this way. for a sec. to make it over there but how to close the distance if only we had a harpy snare smoke beacon to hand we could lure a harpy here no frank we don't buy into those gimmicks Oh, there has to be a way up there without a harpy snare beacon. While travelling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? Mm -hmm. 
Now, how do I get up there? ourselves a pat on the back don't want to use a shitty shit beacon Yoink. Materials such as this can be combined to craft things. Okay, Frank. Wish me luck. Nice. <sighs> Didn't I see a chest up here? Try to keep up, Frank. I pray this note finds someone who can help me. Harpies assailed me on the road. Ended up grabbing hold of one of their talons, and the beast had carried me all the way up here. Now I can't find a way down. I don't know what to... Uh... I guess he just got eaten. hereabouts. Now, how do I get down? Guess the same way that guy should have. I want to get up there. Hey look, a quest! <coughs> Pretty sure that's a dynamic quest. Unless what's her name's down there? Ulrika? Which I guess she could be. No, uh, that's got a dynamic quest written all over it. Hello friend. Your 
safe. Sort of, maybe. This is for you, Master. I thought it might come in useful. Why, thank you, dear. Something for the trouble. That's alright. <clears throat> I appreciate the fish, I guess. Now, let's go explore where we want to be. Gobos. One ill type dodge, and I'm covered in bruises. I feel like I've been here before. I'm thinking of another tower. Yeah, there's a campfire and a Frankstone here. A decent spot to make camp, assuming there are no monsters about. Mm. You fond of those eyes? Keep them to yourself. Should have Desmond. Look, Arisen! A ballista! Yoink. <laughs> These guys are well rude. Wag that tongue at me again, and I'll cut it out. are of little use to us at present, I fear. By harpies. How embarrassing. Frank? You wish me to return? At once, Master. No, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. You're going to return. To the quick! That was impeccably Thanks, timed, Frank. Arisen. That's what you get. What? Saved your life, Sova.
Now there's a worthy prize. If only to work so far away. Where? What? Oh. Yeah, that is a worthy prize if only it weren't so far away. Okay, Frank. No, there's no way I'm making that jump. Well, I've done my good deed for the day, resin that one guy. I'll gather these now. Twould be a shame to forget their location when we need them most. Well, <clears throat> I was hoping that would uh, lead us into this area, which I do firmly believe is going to open up. Maybe we need to go down there. Maybe. Oh, a ballista! Master! Goblins! Who just shot me? I've got a good feeling about this one. Safe. Oh, boy, not bad, eh? <gasps> You've my gratitude. I've been meaning to thank you. Here. Why don't we have a taste? There's surely no harm in it. What? See that path? Level are we? Uh, I don't know, really. Like 35, maybe? Oh, we prevailed by the skin of our teeth. Let's have a look. 36. That's alright, isn't it? While 
in another world. I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? Hmm. The sun descends. Night will be upon us soon. Invisible wall? Okay, I guess that answers whether or not you can go into those mountains. I don't really appreciate it though. Keep up the fight! I'm on my way! Let's rest. <clears throat> Let's pay for this ox cart. This ox cart's bound for Burnwell. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Riding in an ox cart would be a welcome reprieve. Come on then, Frank. I've paid for it. Frank, do you want to accept your welcome reprieve and join me in the ox cart? No? There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. That's classic Frank, that is. Master, I'd love to do this. Okay, let's do it. Nah. No raid, no raid, no raid. Yeah. <clears throat> I heard a rumor that this land was once a kingdom of beastrons. You're always saying that, Frank. Let's rest. There are worse things than turning in early, I must say. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, Frank's a bit a bit mental, honestly. Quest not completed. Oh, new equipment. It was just as daunting to battle. St um, <clears throat> exactly the same cape. Okay. Our adventure continues. Right. Where could this wizard town be? Place of learning. I really feel like this entire area of the map is not going to end up unexplored. It'd be really weird if it was. If I was a place of learning, where would I be? Yeah. 
He'll be up here. How much gold do I have? Uh, not that much, really. <laughs> Seventy grand. It's not that much. Like the weapons in Batal are quite expensive. Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? Just for you, Frank, in the hope that you'll never ask us to do it again. Let's see where that ladder leads. Frank, where is this mythical ladder? Oh. <clears throat> totally worth it. <laughs> We're no assassin. find this law place because I bet the wizard guy is going to be there. Have I done Malcolm Quest? Uh, going to be honest, I've got no idea what Malcolm Quest is. And yet I feel like I have. What's Malcolm Quest? by the morgue. Uh, maybe? That's a big old maybe, that one. to a Frankstone. <laughs> oh, is that the mine? It's the aqueduct cave. Yeah, we've been in there.
I think I finally want to get to that ancestral tomb, you know. Every time I've tried to go there, I've got distracted. That's not to say we won't get distracted this time. But I'm definitely going to give it the old college try. What's this place? Oh, the Gigantus walking the earth, that's right. Here's where I want to be. Unexplored path. I can't wait to find out what's inside. This is chaos. to have come through unscathed. Oh, oh Frankstone. Cool. Oxen are to be found here, of all places. Hmm. Is this where the dragon is? No. Goblins approach. Look, like it's somewhere around here. Forgive me, but there's another matter I've been thirsting to speak of. Uh -huh. Namely... Oh, I just gave up on that one. <clears throat> uh? Where's this lead? This game would serve itself well by having like 50% less what random dog shit enemies in the wilderness. 
While traveling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? Like, yeah, I get it. The world is populated by goblins. But you know what? After the first 500 or so, they lose their charm. I hope at some point we get to, like, actually make the world less dangerous. That'd be cool. Then I wouldn't mind this. If we can do something about it later. Feast your eyes on this. Like, oh, less goblins You're will safe spawn with now me. because you've killed the king of the goblins or whatever. Yeah, that would be cool. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Cause uh honestly, fighting goblins every time I walk ten feet does get a little bit old. <clears throat> Best keep an eye on both ends of the bridge, just in case. Totally frank. A frank stone, always welcome. Though we haven't needed Look, one. Look, master, a chest. We must find a way to open it. Must we, though, Frank? What kind of chest is it? And couldn't you have pointed it out when I was literally standing over there? It's a wooden chest. I'm not going to lose any sleep over it.
At least I feel a sense of progression in this game. I appreciate that. You're not I do legitimately feel stronger. I know I just got my ass beat by a goblin. To be fair, it's a whole goblin. Unless I have to go all the way round. Speaking Elvish. This fair more fat indome. This funyemen and fallacimir. Cool. I don't know why I was so happy to meet an elf, but I was. Oh my god, we're wrecking this This brute has quite the temper! to make short work of Cyclopses. Awesome. There's still four vocations I haven't found. Meh. Four vocations, huh? The old four vocation ruse. Hey, what's this? Could it be the knowledge town? It looks kind of town esque, although it also looks kind of beaten to death. Look, master, a treasure chest. Mountain ruins. We shall ruins. have to find a way to reach it. Um, I was really hoping that was going to be Law Town. You're right, Frank. We do need to find a way to reach that chest. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
Maybe mountain ruins will turn into Law Town. Kind of like that one place. Elf land? Maybe there's an elf town. That'd be awesome. Sod off wolves. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Oh, elves. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? I'm sure you did, Frank. I'm sure you did. Where the wolves? Sometimes I wish Frank wouldn't bring up the fact that he's found treasure chests in other worlds. I don't feel like I'm going to be stuck here forever going, where's that freaking chest? The sound of a wolf. Is it an ogre? <sighs> but I've got fire now, so hopefully this will be. Hello, Frank. This fruit has quite the temper! 
awesome. Now, oh, where's the, the rain has let up at start. I'm just assuming there's an elf. Elvish village we over here. Fight. This is a relatively safe assumption. Have a gander at my wares. You shan't re. It. Pleasure doing business with you. Well, it takes two to make a sale. And this seller had nothing to tempt us with. Our yeah. funds are better spent elsewhere. Ah. Lights. Surely there's elves around here. They wouldn't just leave random lights in the forest for no reason. I forgot I got rid of my light spell. Another Frank Stone. That ladder looks promising, but we'll have to drop it down from above. Where? ladder maybe it's like uber high oh it is look it's all the way up there hmm now there's a worthy prize if only to work so far away Yoink. <clears throat> Not the most worthy of prizes, but I'll take it. This has to be an elven village. <laughs> Look, there's all sorts of weird shit going on. A bridge. While traveling oh, well. beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? No. Maybe. Where's my elves? Where's my elves? Eh? Ingredients noon are glow. plentiful hereabouts. I need noon glow. So maybe I should harvest this stuff in the noon. Ah, yes. Maybe yes. Sacred Arbor, forest home of the elves. I did just hear a monster. At least I think I did. Bye. 
by my eye. You lack surety in your step. Not to worry. You'll find your feet in time, I'm sure. Salma Arendra. Alekano Nandiri. Sohiro Molis. Halan Ostolintan. Non when they hit off. Hmm, These elves sound cool, but you just know that they're going to be saying shit like, We should add an archer to our ranks. I have a knack for gathering items. Elelote and fear and anduin, more mate fa elecano, osto silfa malantha alecano mine in fair avehum. But enough about me. <clears throat> Getting proper rest is an important duty in its own right. Trestaraton gave us Traveling nothing. in other worlds is all very exciting, but I'd sooner stay by your side, Arisen. Yeah. I have a feeling right fortune shall favor us this day. <clears throat> hey, the elves have got quite nice beds. You get like a proper room each in this place. Normally it's like pay us two grand for the privilege of sleeping on the floor. Mm. We need to teach Frank to speak Elvish. Oh, elves! <laughs> what weapons do you sell? Bindamun. Akayel fil Kalawin nunli Jesus Christ! A room far in Italy. So much for elves staying eternally young, eh? Eh, the weapon names being in Elvish is not that bad. That's a sorcerer weapon. That is great. I kind of want one. Very expensive and worse than what we're wearing. Moravin less men loom in Lalastar. Yonk. 
This material is just what we need to better our equipment. Mm. Ilmen Arenfanne. Hey, is that their archery range? Cool. <clears throat> I like this elf town already. The Arbahart. Do you reckon I can kill it? Kinda looks already dead. <laughs> Sir, please get down from there. That's our sacred temple. I wonder if an ox cart comes here. An elven ox cart. One thing's for sure. I'm going to put a port crystal down. Ilmen Arenfanne. Elote and fear, Osto Silfa Malantha Alecano Mine in fair Averhum. It's our last port crystal. Anger to Telpe. Yeah, Anger to Telpe. Totally. Valis Haranum, Hilana fear in the year. The port crystal is set, but we'll have need of a fairy stone should we seek to make use of it. Yeah. Secrets? Elven secrets? Get that for you. Mm -hmm. ah. This actually looks potentially secret esque. The Arborist's home. I guess that's their ruler? Leratindome in Garina. Yoink. <laughs> if 
You got nothing else, Arborist? Might that nice. be a Waitstone shard? Oh, how lucky we are to have stumbled across one! I'm sure we're doing a lot for human elf relations. I haven't thrown a single one of them in the river. <laughs> Sun bloom. Yeah, I need it to be like evening. And then I guess that will turn into Noon Bloom. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. <clears throat> Knock yourself out, Frank. Methinks I've an idea of where Sir Ulrika might have gone, Master. Really? I can guide you there if you wish. No, it's okay. As you wish, I shall return directly. There's some gems I've probably collected that sell for a lot in the elf town. Well, yeah, there's some that sell for loads in um, Batal. Jasper sells for loads in Batal. You should keep all your Jasper until you hit Batal. I haven't found a single Seeker's token in this place. It's very upsetting. She hasn't said aught catches the light. Here you are, Master. I hope you like it. I found it myself. Right. <clears throat> We're going to call it a day there. I'm happy to have found the elf town. I'm not happy that we haven't found uh, the law town. Trying to judge the spacing between the towns. It's like vaguely consistent. So. Well, there isn't one here. If there was, I'd say it was consistent. Maybe it's. Along here? Could be along here. I think that is going to be where the entrance to our ancestral chamber is. Remember the ancestral chamber that we've never gotten to? It's probably just along this path. And then you go up here, and then you come out here, and then it gives you a shortcut. For sure. <clears throat> uh, so it could be over here. So look, there's a path this way. And there's clearly more land up here. Or it could be down beyond the checkpoint rest town. Or it could be... I doubt it's in B uh, Batal. Yeah, there's a few places it could be. My main guess is it's up here. 
<clears throat> then again, you can kind of see the main roads. I'm assuming it's going to be on a main road. I should check where that goes. Hmm. All the little paths and stuff. Did I actually go that far out this way? So maybe there isn't any map up here. How far does that road go? Literally just to there. Hmm. I also want to check out that mountain ruin. We did make good progress. <clears throat> and we've got lots of new stuff to do. I also want to figure out what we do with that ring. The ring that proves we're a friend of that kid. But that's fine. <clears throat> Time for me to go to bed. It has been a pleasure. Frank does indeed stand resolute. Talking as much nonsense as always. Enjoy the rest of your night. And I shall catch you guys next time. Adios.